There's no question that the rise of, of our football program and our athletic program and the entire university uh, is really remarkable. It's really a one and the same relationship between the community and Boise State. It's the center of pride. It's the source of identity. Founded in 1932, Boise State began life as a junior college. In 1933, the school fielded a football team, which recorded an inauspicious 1-2-1 record in their inaugural season. But the arrival of a new coach would quickly change the Broncos' fortunes. The football program's success goes way back to Lyle Smith, who was uh, the longtime football coach for over 20 years. Lyle is really the father of our football program and really is to Boise State what John Wooden is to UCLA. In 20 years of coaching, he lost 26 football games. So he's a hard act to follow, but a great act to follow when it comes to, to building a program. In 1958, Boise State won the Junior College National Championship and a decade later easily jumped to the NCAA's small college division. By 1973, after eight consecutive winning seasons, they moved to Division II. In 1978, they were ready for Division I AA and just two years later claimed their second national championship. But trepidation still lingered when the Broncos decided to make the move to Division I A in 1996. There was a lot of concern in the community and questions about, well, will we ever win nine games again? Will we ever be able to win a conference championship again? We didn't know the answer to that, but we felt that we had the support that we had the ingredients necessary to move to the next level. The winning has continued. The almost sold out crowds have continued. That hasn't changed. The awareness for the program has changed though. If I went to Boston and I was in the airport and I didn't know anybody and I wore this hat, I could meet somebody pretty quickly. I couldn't have done that 30 years ago. Before, in the past when we recruited, the only thing that maybe they knew about us is, hey, you got a blue field. And that got us started. Now they know usually a lot more than that. And if they're liking us and some of the things they see, once they come up here and take a look, you know, everybody's the same thing. It's like, wow, I, I can't believe this place. I didn't, I didn't realize it was like that. The continued success of the Broncos had a positive impact on both the school and the city, culminating in the 2007 Fiesta Bowl, when Boise State defeated Oklahoma 43 to 42, completing their transformation from junior college upstart to a nationally recognized powerhouse. We never, ever, back in the 70s and the 80s, ever thought it would be this big or this huge. The following year, Boise State enrollment topped 19,000 for the first time in school history. Later in 2008, their fundraising efforts peaked at $30.5 million, the best year ever for the university. So everybody's tied together in this community. We kind of all need each other, and you know, when one phase is doing well, it kind of affects us all. We've been very, very successful, more successful than anybody would have dreamed. But now there is a belief, and, and we've kind of crashed that ceiling, and we know that you can win a national championship uh, in Boise. As good as it's been, uh, I think we kind of all feel like there's still a lot more to us, that it can continue to grow, can continue to get better if we uh, pay attention to the right things and focus on the important things.